Good morning students and welcome to online physical science class. Today I am discussing about the position and nature of images by concave mirror. First condition is when object is placed at infinity. When an object is at infinity, then the rays coming from it is almost parallel to principal axis. Hence, the image form is at focus. See the diagram. This is a concave mirror. In this diagram, this is a concave mirror. This is principal axis and from infinity, parallel ray rays are coming. After Reflecting, it is moving like this and it is moving like this. This is the intersection point of these two rays. So, this is the obviously point one point image will be formed over here. But here, the, the meeting point of the two reflection, reflective rays is this one. So, that's why if you will draw one, if you will draw one straight line on principal axis from that particular intersection point, so you will get the image. That means image will form at focus. Case 2 is when object is placed beyond C. That means beyond center of curvature. If object placed beyond C, then the image location will be between F and C for a concave mirror. Now see the diagram. This is a concave mirror. This is the object here that is a candle. Now rays are coming. One is parallel to principal axis. After reflection it is going and passing through focus. And another one is coming and passing through C or center of curvature. That means after reflection also it will go back through that particular point. Now the intersection point of these two rays is this A. So that means image will form over here. So this is the object. Uh, this is the object and this is the image. A dash B dash. Case number 3. Object placed at C. See so this is the object. And this is the image. One ray is coming which is parallel to principal axis after reflection it is passing through the focus. And another ray is passing through the focus only. So after reflection again it is going back to the focus and uh, through the focus. So this is the image here. Size of object is equal to size of image. So here the two rays emerging from the object are one parallel to the principal axis and other passing through the focus of the mirror. These rays after reflection form an image at point C. The image formed has the same size as that of the object and it is real and inverted. The next one, when object between C and F, that means between central of center of curvature and focus. So for concave mirrors, when the object is between C and F, the image will be beyond C and will be enlarged and inverted. For concave mirrors, when the object is between F and the mirror, the image will be behind the mirror and will be enlarged and upright. So here see, this is the object. One ray is parallel to the principal axis. After reflection, it is going through the are passing through the focus and another ray passing through center of curvature. This is the meeting point. So, image is formed over here. Case 5. When object is placed at F, that is at focus. When object is at focus of the concave mirror, hence the image is formed at infinity. 
and image is real, inverted and highly magnified. See, this is or these are all parallel rays. Object is at focus. So, image is formed at infinity. That's why we cannot see the image. When object is placed between P and F, P for pole and F for focus, it is in between P and F, this is the object. Then we are assuming that image is formed behind the concave mirror. So when the object is placed between principal focus and pole of a concave mirror, an enlarged virtual and erect image is formed behind the mirror. Thank you students. Draw the diagrams in your physical science exercise book and make a table of position of objects, position of images and nature and size of images. For any subject related doubts or queries, please email me at shudeshnavan.sma at the rate of outlook.com. We also welcome your responses by way of your views and feedback on the PPTs or videos at feedback.stmichaelsacademy at the rate of gmail.com.